Welcome to Learn with Morel. Today, we're cracking the code behind super speedy messages. Have you ever wondered how you can send a text or play a game online and everything happens so fast? It's like magic, right? Well, it's actually about something called information transfer. It's a way of sending messages and data from one place to another. And guess what? Everything uses secret codes to travel in the digital world. Intrigued? Now, let's dive into the mystery of messages. Ever wondered how people sent messages before the age of smartphones and computers? Long before the internet, people devised ingenious ways to communicate. They relied on letters carried by messengers, drums echoing through forests, and smoke signals rising into the sky. However, these methods were slow and limited by distance. Then, a game changer arrived in the form of Samuel Morse and his invention, the telegraph. This device allowed messages to be sent over long distances using a system of dots and dashes known as Morse code. Just imagine, each letter of the alphabet had its own unique combination of beeps and boops. Soon after, inventions like the telephone and radio built upon the idea of coded signals allowing voice and sound to be transmitted across continents. These advancements set the stage for the digital revolution that was yet to come. Now, let's travel forward in time to our world of tiny lights and big pictures. Have you ever noticed how everything on your screen is made of tiny squares called pixels? Well, just like these pixels form a picture, in the world of technology, Everything is built from a special code of ones and zeros. These ones and zeros are like tiny switches that can be either on or off. Now, imagine building a picture with these tiny switches. When they light up, they form letters, numbers, and even images. It's like a giant puzzle where each piece is either a one or a zero. And guess what? It's not just pictures and words. Even the music you listen to and the videos you watch are stored as patterns of ones and zeros. Each note, each frame, each moment is a part of this intricate code. So next time you're texting, gaming, or streaming your favorite show, remember, it's all thanks to these tiny lights and big pictures. From grooves to patterns, let's explore the magic of music in the digital world. Do you know how your favorite songs are stored on your phone or computer? We're about to unravel this musical mystery. Long ago, music was stored physically on objects like CDs, cassettes, and vinyl records. These items had grooves and bumps that your player would read to play the music. But today, we've moved on to a more magical method. Now, your beloved melodies are stored as patterns of ones and zeros, just like those secret messages we talked about earlier. These binary codes are like a special language that your devices understand. Imagine your favorite song. Can you guess how many ones and zeros are needed for just that one song? Millions, that's right, millions of ones and zeros all working together to bring you the beat. And it's not just music. Photos, documents, games, they all use the same magical code. Now that we've seen how music and messages travel, let's learn how to whisper to machines. Did you know that we can talk to computers using a special language called code? Well, we absolutely can. Computer programming is like whispering instructions to a machine. When we write code, we're telling the computer what we want it to do. It's like saying, hey computer, play this cool music, or hey computer, show me pictures of puppies. There are all sorts of programming languages out there, each with its own set of rules, just like different human languages. Some are used to build websites, others to create video games, and even some to make robots move. As we whisper to machines, we unlock a world of creativity and fun. We've journeyed from drums and dots to digital data, all thanks to the power of codes. It's truly fascinating, isn't it? So, let's continue exploring this world of coding and discover the magic it holds. Thank you for joining us on this code-cracking adventure. See you next time on Learn with Morale.